Parents across Central Florida are trying to decide what is best for their children when it comes to returning to the classroom. Several deadlines are coming up. Orange County school officials make a decision tomorrow on reopening plans. Mayor Jerry Deming says it's a decision they are monitoring. So we are a large school district uh, and uh, I'm certain after conversations that I had this morning with the school superintendent, uh, Dr. Uh, Jenkins, uh, that uh, the, the underlying goal that they have is to, to open the school safely uh, for both the students, uh, faculty, and, and others who would be visiting the schools. If they can't open it safely, then they won't open it. News 6's Lauren Cervantes is live with how local school districts are planning to move forward this fall and how you can make your voice heard right now, Lauren. Well, as we near August, parents are trying to figure out what their kids are going to be doing, if they're going to be going to school, if they're going to be staying at home. Well, tomorrow, schools take that next step in the process of reopening by voting on their plans. Their plans that one county tells me could end up changing. The plan that is rolled out, that is um, carved out, so to speak, may have to be adjusted as we move forward. But as it stands right now, the Orange County Public Schools Board will be voting tomorrow on these three options for parents. Face-to-face -face learning, virtual, and innovative learning. It's a big week. It's an important week. OCPS says the meeting is scheduled for 12.30 p.m. and they will also be streaming it live online. And Orange County Schools Chief Communications Officer says they are expecting a lot of eyes on that meeting. The last work session was the most viewed uh, work session or board meeting that we had ever had. Seminole County Public Schools Board is also meeting tomorrow. They have a work session at 8.30 a.m. and a school board meeting at 5.30. SCPS says they will be voting on these four options, face-to-face -face learning, Seminole Connect, Seminole County Virtual School, and a hybrid option which combines all three. Seminole school officials say parents will have until July 24th at noon to make their selection. Parents in Osceola have until July 15th to choose which option their child will be doing. Well, here's how the public can weigh in tomorrow. Take a look. Orange County Public Schools says the meeting will be live streamed online. School officials say comments can be emailed to public comment at OCPS.net. They had to be submitted by 5 o'clock tonight. Actually, that was by 5. We're past 5, but people can still weigh in tomorrow. Officials say you can call in during that meeting. Now, for Seminole County Schools, officials say that both meetings can be viewed online or by watching a live stream on campus. SCPS says that People can send written comments, but they have to be in by 4.30 tomorrow, and they can also send in video comments as well. There's a submission form on their website. In Orlando, I'm Lauren Cervantes, getting results, News 6.